Okay, as we brought you on last week's show, we were expecting a, another interest rate, interest rate increase. It happened 0.25% up to 0.5%. It was strongly expected and predicted. And yes, it has come into the marketplace. It will affect obviously borrowing and, and those on trackers would have seen an increase pretty much immediately. And there are gonna be concerns about how competitive interest rates, mortgage rates, sorry, will be on lending because of the interest rates uh, increase. Now, the reason for the Bank of England doing that is because they want to soften one, uh, the market and, and cool that down. And also they want to pull in inflation. And thus, that is the mechanism that they're using. What do I think will happen with the, the market because of that? I think, firstly, it was built in. So I think we've known for quite a long time that, that was going to be the case, especially off the back of last year's increase. So I think built in and expected. So no surprise there. What it will do is it will test the waters in the sense of will still people um, be able to buy as much or will it push them to go into refinance and want to lock and secure good terms on their mortgages. So yes, Bank of England have brought it in to try and call the market and inflation. Will it have a short time effect on the market? Probably not enough to create the impact that the Bank of England are looking for, but it will have an impact. And we are seeing obviously um, across the board increases in housing stock in terms of pricing, an increase in rental stock as well, rents uh, for certain product, houses for certain product for sale uh, are going up. Um, and so that is something that the Bank of England are looking at. 